Is it a flush that beats a full house or not? That's a full house. Oh, it's not my tank? That's a, believe me, I, I know about houses. I built mine out of straw. I'm not an idiot. Am I going to get to put the cuffs on someone or what? I remember, Ted, pieces of the puzzle make funny shapes, but they still fit together in the end. Boy, you're just full of those, aren't you? I think we are closer to the bandit than we've ever been before, Chief. The clues to find him are right here in this room. Oh. Here it is. That's what I've been saying all night. Tell me we're back to square one. Okay, Mr. Fire. It would seem that all of you came together tonight by mistake. Maybe you naughty neighbors butted heads so that we could get to the real truth. For the goody bandit. That's right. The bandit's still at large. There's been a lot of finger pointing tonight, but now all fingers point to the bandit. Not my finger. Oh, no. You were just out damaging forest property, Ooh. cutting down the redwoods we all call home. <laughs> Big guy like I, I, you, you could probably take whatever you want from little goody-loving creatures, couldn't you? But someone robbed me. Have we lost track of that? That's right. Someone did. Maybe a snack food competitor. Right, Granny? Now hold on a pea-picking minute. I may lead a double life full of secrets and deception, but that's no reason to be suspicious. Huh? A woman like you could have a lot to gain, stealing all those recipes. And that's how she makes her goodies so good. Huh? Or she could just be another victim. What? Of a hungry wolf. <laughs> ah, the wolf did it. Talk about profiling. Why should we trust someone who wears disguises for a living? Maybe he's not a wolf at all! You got me. I'm a poodle. Just haven't been to the barber shop in a long time. This is all just a big joke to you! I just followed the little girl here. You leave my granddaughter alone! Yes, now we get to the little red. A girl with a basket on the run. Where is she anyway? Chief, no, I was just... What? <sighs> the recipes are gone! I have to speak to you about this pretty me. He's not pretty mean. Is he giving off too much of a creep, even the Loompa vibe? No, it's just that he bites. He's a fighter. What's wrong, mini me? Something you want to tell him? Teething. Yeah. Get me the President of the United States of America! He's on. What do you want, Dr. Evil? Mr. President, in 12 hours, I will destroy Washington, D.C. with this giant laser. What the... <laughs> Mini-me, stop pumping the laser. <laughs> okay, honest to God. Why don't you and the giant laser get a frickin' room, for God's sakes? Mr. President, after I destroy Washington, D.C., I will destroy another major city every hour on the hour. That is, unless, of course, you pay me $100 billion. <laughs> Dr. Evil, this is 1969. That amount of money doesn't even exist. <laughs> Bajillion, bajillion dollars. <laughs> Come on, Mr. President. Show me the money. Show you what money? Show me the money. Show me the money. You had me at hello, tear. Nothing? It's 1969. Jerry Maguire won't even come out for another 30 years. Nobody knows what you're talking about, ass. Scott, daddy's working, okay? And when you're in the main chamber, try and use the big boy voice, okay? Thank you. Mr. President, allow me to demonstrate the awesome lethality of the Alan Parsons Project. Fire the laser! Damage report! Damage report! It's okay. Relax, 
Henry, that was just footage from the movie Independence Day, but the real laser would be a lot like that. Yeah. Scary. Now, Dr. Eagle. Talk to the hand, because the face don't want to hear it anymore. What hand? Talk to your hand? You ate all that in a bag of potato chips. What are you talking about? Don't go there, girlfriend. Mm-hmm. Who's girlfriend? Don't mess with me. I'm one crazy mofo. I had to pop a cop because he wasn't giving me my props in Oak Town. You know? I heard that somewhere. You're an idiot. Mr. President, I think we have an understanding. Bye-bye. Dr. Evil, what are our plans regarding Austin Powers? Austin Powers? He's the snake to my mongoose. Or the mongoose to my snake. Either way, it's bad. I do know animals. But I do know this. This time it's personal. Kill him.